My name is Ross Stewart, and the Foundations class has changed my life in a couple of ways. The first is, it got me connected to the community in a way I've never been connected before. Uh, I've been here for three years, but I didn't know the richness of all the people I would get to meet in this class. The second thing is, it gave me an understanding of what spiritual practices are really all about. It took me from a place of not understanding some ways how to change my life or how to deal with the situations that I found I kept repeating and making the same mistakes over and over again. The spiritual practices actually gave me a venue for getting from there to some better place. I really recommend this to everybody. And how come I waited so long? You know, and when you were in foundations class, that's the technique and the fire. Right? The technique are the steps for the affirmative prayer. The fire is the conviction, the belief that says, the feeling that says, I know how this works. And I know that if I set my mind to it, and I put my consciousness around it, and I hold my intention, and I do this prayer, that the law will handle the rest, right? And so that's, that's a part of the feeling, which is, which is our deep conviction um, that prayers are answered, and, and that it matters what we believe. When I go back, I go to the feeling, and I want myself to get in there, and the words kind of disappear and don't mean as much, right. but then I'm in the faith, I know it's going to happen. And it, to just that feeling. And it's just given me a lot of, ignited me in a way where I can't allow myself to be small. So many of Petra's talks are just like a fire underneath saying, go for it, go for it. Let go of that fear because you can't not step into where you're feeling called to go. Through all of the the lessons we've learned here and all of the insight we've gained and, and, and the remembering we've done through Petra's teachings and classes and discussing with friends and community, it's, it's just so clear what the truth is that, that we do create our own reality and we're able to bring that to fruition, we're able to manifest that in our lives. So that it becomes more effortless um, and more habitual that when you say, oh, I'm going to meditate now and you, I'm going to go to my sacred place, you know, every part of your being already knows what that means and just immediately you go there. Okay. I may not always be coming from, you know, that right place with my kids or with my job, but I always have the opportunity to step back, use the tools that I've learned and create a better life for myself and my family. I have transformed just from the old teachings um, that I grew up believing that I was punished and penalized, but knowing that I'm loved and appreciated for each and everything that I do, I know I'm free. And it's just great to know that you're free, believe that you're free, and live as a free being, a spirit on this earth. I feel good and kind. I feel my heart myself, I can walk more firmly in that truth, and I can show up as that truth uh, on, on a day-to-day -day basis, and people notice a difference about me. Being that it, it's been food for my thought patterns, it's been uh, food for my consciousness, it's given me a uh, truth dialect to uh, nullify my monkey chatter, to see things on a, from a different vibration different perspective and to grow, to grow spiritually, to grow uh, specifically in my thought pattern. It's like the time is now. So this is my life and this is your life and it's in our control what we're going to do with it, you know, and I don't want life to fly by and have any regrets and the best way that I can be, not have that happen is to be fully present in my life and that's definitely what the center gives me. Before coming here, I was in a lot of pain and I didn't see a way out of it and um, through discovering that wholeness and making the connections with the people here and being able to see that wholeness in myself, it did, it, it put a flame under me, it ignited me to then put these tools to practice and, and start creating, co-creating with spirit the life that I live now where I feel ignited. I wake up and I'm happy and it's full and rich. It's like it's like going from watching life on a little black and white screen to full technicolor digital surround sound. That's that's the igniting transformation that I've experienced. I was